Good evening, my wonderful friends. Today is another session that we have with Leszek, and he has some announcement to make. Okay. This boy is always surprising me. So, before I begin, join us in a little game. Have a look at the questions I posted in the description of this video. Close your eyes and answer each question separately, and then resume the video to see if the visions match Psychic Bilatus. Everyone that takes part in writing something in the comments gets automatically entered into a draw for a free video reading. Check out www.psychicdialecta.com for more information on what that reading entails. The winner will be announced in the next video. Alright. <laughs> so, start with the questions. Okay, so the question is from Sheldon Fat. Dr. Charles Hall is a nuclear physicist who claims to have interacted with three extraterrestrial aliens, three species of extraterrestrials at Area 51. Is there or has there is there or has there been extraterrestrial aliens at Area 51? So it looks like they are. There is some connection, there is a chain of an IC3, things like that. So they are connected, they are intertwined with something. He might be on something. He might have connected, but they are connected very weird way. Yeah. It's something that I never have seen, but it's waves. It's this way it will be more like a symbol. So it's waves, so it's like they're coming and going? Because that's kind of what he was talking about. It is something that he's... I saw them this way, but they might be like that. You see the waves. Primitive way of growing waves. Is what he says about his experience with the aliens true? Okay. Going backwards 100 years ago, you see someone who is going through the safari with big lunette, safari uniform. Mm -hmm. And that person is looking through the bushes how the primitive people are dancing and celebrating life and so on. So it is something that he is observing. I don't know if he has too much interaction. But it's someone who is dedicating his life to, to experience something like that. Well, that's kind of what he said about I don't know them, anything right? what, you, what you are asking me. And that's he made a metaphor about, uh, about apes. He, he said something about, from their perspective, we're like apes. So they're very cautious around us. Mm -hmm. And... They're very, you know, their guards are very much up. And he is to them like that scientist with the binnacles who is observing them. Mm -hmm. How they interact, how they enjoy themselves. So, both ways. For, the, for those primitive people, probably the observer was someone kind of cuckoo too. Does area <laughs> so you can't say who is the the uh, observator uh, observer and who is the person who is observe? Does Area Fifty One have um, some sort of psychic guards? Like, does the government employ psychic blockers to stop people from remote viewing Area Fifty One? If so, they have the waves that they are making a net, 
pass me another paper. <laughs> because it is something that... And it's a net. Of things. So they are... Sandy and the odd thing, it was the white lily growing here. The flowers who are poison. Okay, so this is the flower that can poison you when you are, when you will drink the water, uh -huh. and the flower is in that water. It can be poisoning. Okay. So there is a symbol in that. <laughs> a lot of long time ago, apparently, women were poisoning their husbands that way. I don't know if that's true, but that was the symbol for me that I have seen. And there is a net, so they are sending some waves so you can't cross that line. They don't want you to cross the line, maybe for psychics. For, for... Can you cross that line? <laughs> oh my gosh. There's an area in uh, in Area 51 that's called Area 52. Um, can you go into the hangars and then into the basement and see what's there? Don't tell me where to go. Over <laughs> here. So there is a place that they are landing and going away. Okay. Yeah. I saw going through that tunnel. I was going through that. And then there is a door open. The similar door that I have seen in a previous video that I didn't want to cross because it was in somewhere in the space. Okay. So this time I went there. And I saw oh, and they are taking off like a, it looks like the fish that has huge wings. You say you got, I got like a bit of a headache too. It's not, yeah. My blood pressure just went up. <laughs> My, it's going up and down so fast. It is somewhere that they are, they have like those big planes that have It looks more like a, sorry, not the best draw, but it is something this way. It was flying away like a rocket, like a spaceship, something like that. So you saw something fly? Going, moving, yes, fast. Took, taking off so fast and going away. And it is, I connect this with a fish because it has that bluish color and it's, it's actually feeling like it's organic. Yeah, that's what they say. You've you never, heard that before, that those ships are organic. No. You've never heard that? No, you know, it's not my cup of tea. I'm somehow you and my mom. Yeah. No, no, <laughs> that's what they say. A lot of people that have those experiences say, say exactly I'm so that. afraid to attract them. I'm honestly, I am afraid. Once... We were in a hot tub with my husband, and I saw, and my husband couldn't even notice this. It went so fast above us, some connection of, and it went, and I thought that must be the, the UFO because it went so fast. It was three, two, and one. Uh -huh. And my husband, out oh, birds, I said, not this time of the day. <laughs> not in the not, not, and they don't glow that bright. Oh, okay. So it and it was quite low. So. <laughs> so, next question, um, Robin Williams. Everyone knows that famous actor and comedian Robin Williams has passed on. Why did he choose? Why did he choose to go out the way that he did? C. 
symbol of picnic table. We have a lot of those picnic tables in the forest in Canada. And he is hitting with his hand and it's going apart. So something related to his private life. You go to the picnic table with people who are very close to you, who are the most important. It's not about fancy life. It's not about money making. When you're going to that private place with your family or your close friends for a picnic, you are, you feel that those people are the most important for you. And somehow he was angry about something. So he hit this, like, his hand was like a hammer and broke the table in half. So something went wrong with his connection with his close people. There was not stability anymore. There was something missing in the relationships. Maybe with his wife, with his kids. The people who were not about money. They were about simple life. Can you make contact with the spirit? And what do you want to know? Is there anything he wishes he could have said but didn't? Is there a message that he wants to relay? No matter what, walk on that treadmill and walk and walk and walk. Life is not to, to quit. Just adjust the speed of the treadmill and walk ahead. So sometimes we are in the point that we are so depressed. And one step on a time it doesn't make any big difference because on the treadmill you don't feel that you are achieving anything. You don't give up because you don't feel that you are making any progress. Still, 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 still keep going. So he is advising other people not to go his way. Okay. okay. That's, it. That's what I have seen. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching. Thank you for subscribing. Goodbye. Bye bye. Kręci w głowie po tym UFO. No to jest takie. Normalnie dyzy. Ty myślisz, że to tak kopciut? Normalnie leciałam w tę siatkę. I widzę, że to światło jest takie po prawej stronie. Nie. So myślę, tym razem wejdę. Wtedy się bałam tam w Universe, to się bałam, a tutaj się nie bałam, bo to na ziemi. <laughs> really? Tam w Universe to się bałam. Did you see anything else? Like, what, yeah. Did you get the feeling that they're okay? Like, Tylko wy, wystartowali, tak jak mnie wystraszyła. Did you scare them? Tak szybko wystartowali. Really? Mm -hmm. Możesz dopisać tam, że to I felt like I scared them. So you're saying that they took off because they felt you coming? Something probably. Yes, już nie przyciąga ich do mnie, ja się ich boję. Okay.